Good morning, Gators. Today is Friday, December 2nd. Welcome to Gator Nation News. I'm Jaden. And I'm Dalen. Dalen, how are you feeling today? It's a, it's a beautiful Friday. Pretty good. I, you know, Metro Bloom dropped an album tonight, or last night, and it's, it's real devious, if you ask me, as one would say, villainous. How do you feel about it? Um, pretty good. The one with uh, 21 Savage in the weekend, and the one with Future, oh, maybe not top two. I mean, there's a few of them with Future, so it's not very specific, but The weekend don't miss, 21 don't miss, Metro don't miss. Yeah. Top five producers of all time. And Def- I'm gonna, he passed Kanye. Definitely better than Dark, what's it, Dark? All Heroes Wore Capes, yeah. Right. Well, that's easy. To celebrate the last few days of the semester, we are having the 12 days of Christmas spirit. Today's theme is holiday hair, don't care. Wear your crazy Christmas hair or hat. Monday's theme will be Santa's Little Helpers. Wear your Santa or an elf hat. Hosters hosting a stocking drive to collect the for items for the residents of Regent Care Long Term Nursing Facility. Please consider donating any of the items on this list to brighten their holidays. All items will be collected by Mr. Benavides in A115 or Mrs. Polkin in CT114 until December 12th. Make sure to follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube at Gary Nation Media and on Twitter at Gary Nation Live for the latest news and live updates. And if you're a staff member with interesting stories or information you want included in Gary Nation News, be sure to send us our email at jmedia at dixonisd.org. That's all the news we have for you today. Now for the inspirational quote. There are two ways of arguing with a woman, and neither one works. John Marston said that. We'll see you next week on Gator Nation News. And now for the fun fact of the day. Did you know the Christmas classic, It's a Wonderful Life, was not critically and financially successful when it first came out. However, it found a new life on television because it was in the public domain due to copyright owner not filing a renewal application, making it royalty-free to anyone who wanted to show it. That's it for today. See you next week.